Hi folks, Healthy Prepper here with an idea to make some healthy uh, natural MREs, quick snacks for you to make for your long-term food storage that will be grab and go someday and will last you many, many years. Because we're going to use the triple protection method of, this is an old one, the oxygen absorber, the mylar bag, and the food saver bag to give us the longest length of time possible for our food storage. So I'm going to take a gallon mylar bag and I'm going to cut it in half because these are snack size. So I can get two snack size bags out of one gallon mylar. And I'm just going to seal one end. Turn the vacuum off. It's creating the seal right now. This one is already sealed on the bottom because it was the bottom of the main bag. So I'm ready to go with that one. I can start with this one. So I'm going to start loading it. And what I'd like to put in it are some nuts. These are almonds. Almonds in there. And I'd like to put some sunflower seeds in there. These are the ones that are already shelled. You can put the shelled ones in too. It doesn't matter. You can use any mixture of nuts. There we go. Got those. And I've also got some cashews. I'm going to pop some of these in here. Because these come, this is a paper container and that won't keep the freshness for a very long time the way this system works. So I want to remove them from the paper container. And I also have some pistachio nuts. So I'm going to put a few of those in there. Now I'm going to add some uh, dried fruit. And I made this, uh, these dried apples last year. They were in a vacuum seal bag. And they smell fabulous when they come out of the bag. They're amazing. I'm just going to loosen them up a little bit here. Still very fresh. I had an oxygen absorber in there with them. Worked wonderfully. So in goes some apples. Apples have great nutrition. I leave the skins on. I wash them really good before I dehydrate them. And I leave. And you can use, you can buy pre-dried apples. You don't have to do the dehydrating yourself. But I think it's fun and I think it's such a useful tool for the prepper that I really love my dehydrator. So I love to use it. Here's some bananas that I made last year and they're absolutely what the greatest place to get the bananas is at, if you have a flea market that has a, um, uh, a fresh fruit farmers market there where they have these bananas that they're gonna go bad tomorrow but they're really super ripe and absolutely perfect today but you gotta use them immediately so either you come home and make 75 tons of banana bread or you dehydrate them because they're at their peak flavor and sweetness when they're super super ripe and these are perfect for dehydrating them. And you can usually get a ton of these for next to nothing. That's a great way to save some money on some high quality food. So here you go, dehydrated bananas go in the bag. And I also dehydrated some coconut. I took some coconut flakes from a regular bag of uh, coconut flakes from the store. You can feel there's a little bit of dampness naturally in these coconut flakes, they're not completely dehydrated. So I tossed them on the dehydrator, nice and crispy. And I'm uh, just going to sprinkle a little bit of that in there. Now I'm going to get protein from the nuts. I'm, I'm going to get carbohydrates from the sugar um, in the fruits, the bananas and the apples and that. And I'm going to get some fats from the nuts as well as from the coconut. So you've got all three main food uh, types in here, which is going to be good for the nutrition. Plus you get a variety of foods, so they all bring different minerals and vitamins. Very important. So just set that aside, then get a food saver bag, doesn't need to be very big, just four, about four inches longer than whatever your, the bag you're uh, using is, it's a good rule of thumb. Seal the one end, this comes off a roll so you need to seal one end. I'm just sealing now, I turned off the vacuum because I just need to seal at one end to make the bottom of the bag. And that just takes a second or two. There, got a brand new vacuum seal bag. The easiest way to do this, grab this by the middle and put it in head first or uh, nose first if you will and then turn it 
when it's inside the bag. And then grab either of the silver sides, tap, tap, tap. Grab a fresh oxygen absorber, toss it in there. Sides, tap, tap, tap. And pop it in your food saver, vacuum sealer, or whichever one you use. It doesn't matter. And away it goes. All the air out of here making this super rock hard. Now it's sealing it and it's going to give that nice vacuum seal on top of the mylar protection. The mylar protects it from light and from puncture. The oxygen absorber protects it from the oxygen. There you got it folks. A fast and quick and easy uh, MRE healthy snack with triple protection. I hope you like this idea, folks. Enjoy. Happy, healthy Prepper. Healthy Prepper here.